All right, everyone. So with all the conflicts, crop failures, wildfires, food shortages, and division between people, we don't really know what's going to happen in the future. So I think it's a good idea to always stock up for really long-term scenarios. I know most people think nothing will ever happen to them, but that's what everyone thinks until something happens. So we're going to talk about some foods that preppers should stock up on that can last them up to 30 years. Quick oats. These have carbs and protein, so they'll fill you up and give you energy. You could use it to make oatmeal, granola, oatmeal cookies, and so much more. Store them in mylar bags with oxygen absorbers, and they can last up to 30 years. Pasta. These have carbs and protein, are easy to prepare, and are relatively inexpensive, so most people can buy a good supply every week if they need to. Store them in mylar bags with oxygen absorbers, and they can last up to 25 years. Powdered drink mixes. They're a good source of vitamin C. In a post-collapse scenario, you may end up with vitamin deficiencies, so it's good to have stuff like this. You'll really enjoy this, especially if you've been eating bland food for a really long time and are craving something sweet. Freeze-dried meals. These are great. Just add boiling water straight into the bag, wait a few minutes, and then eat. The only thing with freeze-dried meals is that they are a little expensive and the price keeps going up, so it's not something that everyone can just go and buy a month's worth of it every week. Lentils. These are a good source of protein, which is extremely important because you need to keep up your strength. And if you end up having a protein deficiency, you may end up having issues like muscle dystrophy. And the same thing with these. Just store them in mylar bags with oxygen absorbers and they can last up to 30 years. Powdered milk. It's basically a whole meal and has everything you need. I bought a bunch of it and filled up some food grade buckets. All you have to do to prepare it is mix it with some water. If you don't want to drink milk, it can be used for baking and preparing different foods as well. This could also be a great barter item because I know the average person wouldn't think to store it. If you want to know the one I'm stocking up on, just send me a DM or check out the link tree. If you know any more long-term prepping foods, leave them in the comments.